the reason many of us are having such a hard time finding good quality hair for an affordable price is because many people don't understand what it is that they're actually buying. When you shop with these affordable hair companies, you are buying processed hair, okay? When you buy processed hair, also known as virgin hair, all right, that's what it's called all throughout the industry, you are buying fallen hair. Now, fallen hair is hair that is picked off of salon floors, brushes, combs, whatever, you name it, it's picked off of the floor, and to make it nice and presentable, it's dipped into silicone and different types of chemicals and acid to make it appear better than what it actually is. And that is what gives it the nice and shiny appearance along with the actual texture that it comes with. So this includes body wave, deep wave, kinky girl, and a lot of the other curl patterns that we see whenever it comes to virgin hair, all right? Now this explains why no processed hair company can really guarantee longevity. This also explains why no processed hair company can consistently provide high quality hair. Remember, this hair is picked off of floors of salons, okay? If you've watched several of my videos then you guys already know, you want hair to be Remy. Like Remy is the way that you know that you are on the verge of getting good quality hair. And when the hair is picked up off of the floor and off of brooms and it's just collected in balls like that, it's impossible to ensure that the cuticles are aligned and intact, all right? For those of you that are new to the terminology, Remy hair is a word used to describe how the hair was collected. So Remy hair is collected in this way. They take a, a rubber band and they put it at the base of the donor's head. They then cut below the rubber band and this allows the people collecting the hair to keep the hair in the direction in which it naturally grows okay so that is what we call um, cuticle alignment all right you want your cuticles to be aligned and when the cuticles are misaligned or they are inverted that is what calls serious matting okay so again you want your hair to be Remy hair all right so let's go back to fallen hair okay they're gonna have to take that hair to remove the cuticles because the cuticles are already gonna be an issue since they are misaligned and that is when they go in and they process it with these harsh chemicals and these harsh chemicals do give it a lovely appearance all right but these chemicals are not made to last the chemicals will fade away the chemicals will wash away and then eventually we will be left with the poor quality hair and that is why whenever we buy processed hair we're so scared or nervous to go in and wash because we all know evidently when you wash this hair it does not last all right that is because again this hair was processed so that's why I encourage everyone to become more knowledgeable of what it is that you are purchasing when you are going in to buy processed hair. Now, quick disclaimer, not every processed hair company uses harsh chemicals to process their hair. Some companies do use steam and that steam is used to achieve different textures. However, regardless if you use steam or chemicals, the texture will not last. And if chemicals were used, not only will the texture wash away, but the quality of the hair will begin to get noticeably worse. And that's what a lot of us experience whenever it comes to purchasing processed hair. So I did just want to make a note of that. All in all, if you continue to buy processed hair, you can always expect to deal with inconsistency with hair that has a short lifespan and you will always have to rebuy hair. And I get a lot of people saying, you know, in comments of previous videos, well, I bought from X hair company off of AliExpress and the hair has lasted me X amount of years. And if that is the case for you, I am super thrilled. I am so happy to hear that, okay? But if you continuously buy from them, I guarantee you, you're gonna get one instance where the hair quality is not that good. All right, so this raises the question, you know, what next? What can I do? Where do I find good quality hair? If you want hair that is beautiful and long lasting and hair that is consistently good every single time, all right, <laughs> you gotta buy raw hair. Raw hair isn't picked off of floors of salons, okay, and used combs and used hair brushes. As I mentioned earlier in the video, you want Remy hair and raw hair is 100%. Remy hair okay I personally only have experience with raw Indian hair so I can only speak about raw Indian hair raw Indian hair is collected in Hindu temples and it is a part of a process called tonsure okay it is a religious sacrifice and it is done regularly throughout India and so the hair is donated by real humans all right the hair is then collected washed clean sanitized and then sent out to distributors i.e. me okay this hair is not treated with chemicals this hair is not processed the hair that you receive on the first day is the hair that you will have for years and years to come now remember i said this hair was donated by indians meaning that this is natural hair this hair will last as long as you care for it and as long as you treat it the way you would treat your natural hair that being said it is important that you take care of your hair so this includes things like co-washing it on a weekly basis washing it every two weeks making sure that you are applying moisture and again just taking care of it the way you would your natural hair because it is indeed 
100% human hair, all right? If you adopt these practices, if you take care of the hair, if you're willing to put in the work to maintain your raw hair, your hair will last for years and years. Now, I do wanna say that raw hair is not perfect, and I think a lot of people go into buying raw hair with the impression or with the idea that it is like high quality processed hair, and that is not the case. When you buy raw hair, you're essentially saying that you would rather buy high quality, real human hair as opposed to glossy chemically processed hair that will lose its quality and integrity over time with every wash when you buy raw hair you're saying that you want to know exactly what you're going to get before you purchase it okay instead of gambling with your money and hoping that you get high quality hair and i say that because by definition when you buy raw Indian hair, you know you'll receive quality human hair. And because you're buying real human hair, there's no question about the quality or lifespan of this hair. Again, this is real human hair. So will the hair all look the same? No, okay, each bundle is going to look different because each bundle was donated by one specific donor. I say this in so many videos. I mean, guys, just think about the hair on your head and the hair on my head. We both may have type 4C hair, but at the end of the day, our hair is just not identical. And the same thing is to be expected with real raw hair. Will the hair be unbelievably shiny and have such a high luster and such a uniform curl pattern? No, it will not. You can expect a natural medium luster as opposed to a high and shiny luster. And I do also wanna note that the hair textures will not be uniform, all right? Those textures that we're so used to seeing with processed hair companies, Body Wave, Deep Wave, Kinky Girl, whatever it is that you call it, um, those textures are man-made, all right? So if that's what you're looking for, then you're definitely not looking for raw hair. Again, raw hair is true human hair, and the hair textures are going to reflect the hair textures of the women that donated the hair. Now, raw hair also does frizz, all right? Raw hair gets frizzy because natural human hair gets frizzy. Think about your hair, okay? When you go outside and it's hot, your hair is gonna react with the natural elements and it's going to frizz up, all right? The same thing is to be expected with raw hair. The hair will get frizzy in humid environments. The hair will get frizzy throughout the day. That is just the nature of the beast. That is what is to be expected. But again, remember this is real human hair and these are the things that happen and occur with human hair. Even the hair on our heads, whether you have relaxed hair, whether you have a silk press, whether you have natural hair, whatever it is, you can always expect your hair to react with the natural elements. And the same thing is to be expected with raw hair. You guys know I always say this, I'm not here to sell any dreams raw hair will even shed all right you can expect your raw bundles to shed from time to time it is what happens with all hair extensions keep in mind that raw hair is not processed so everything you know about processed hair goes out the window whenever it comes to dealing with raw hair so now it's up to you guys to decide do you want to buy this hair that has a high luster that is shiny and glossy and has a uniform hair texture that looks good today but probably won't look good next month you know, do you want to have to deal with possibly getting a bad batch of hair? And if so, like if you've answered yes to all of those questions, then go ahead and just get processed hair. And I do not say that facetiously. I truly do mean it. You may want a processed hair look. You may want that body wave texture or that tight curl texture, or you may want hair with high and shiny luster. There's nothing wrong with it. That is okay. Just know that no processed hair company or virgin hair company can guarantee high quality hair. That will last long because by definition, processed hair means that the hair was processed to only look good or to behave this way for such a short period of time or for a duration of time all right there is a cap on the lifespan of processed hair you can also expect the quality of processed hair to vary that is just the nature of the beast now if you want real human hair hair that not only is real but looks good hair that is also high quality and can last a long time then you should buy raw hair However, keep in mind, the same way people are mislabeling their processed hair as virgin hair, there are a lot of companies lying saying that they are selling raw hair when they are not selling raw hair. That is why I started my own raw hair company. I offer 100% raw Indian hair, which is universally regarded as the highest quality of hair. The hair I sell is single donor hair, meaning each bundle was cut from one specific donor. The hair I sell is also Remy hair. As I mentioned throughout the video, you want the hair that you're wearing to be Remy. That ensures that the cuticles are aligned and intact, and that prevents matting, okay? Beyond all of those things, the hair that I sell is also the softest hair that you will ever wear. You're not finding hair softer than this. I stand behind the hair that I sell so much that I also offer a 100% money back 
guarantee. If you shop with my hair company, Juicy Hair Fair, also known as JHA, you don't have to worry about spending your hard earned dollar on something that you weren't expecting, all right? And worst case scenario, let's say I do bullshit you and I don't give you 100% raw Indian hair, you can return it for 100% of your money back. Also wanted to note that I am the only company offering that, all right, on the market. Like nobody else can stand behind their product like that. So that should tell you guys something. If after watching this video, you are not interested in buying the softest hair on the market, you can check out my company www.juicyhairaffair.com again we specialize in 100% raw Indian hair and we only sell raw Indian hair so go ahead and check out the link down below in the description box again the website is www.juicyhairaffair.com and you can follow us on Instagram at juicyhairaffair thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video